I have filmed this makeup look and at the end I will list all of the products and it's just a little more extensive than my five minute makeup so I hope you enjoy. There we go. I really like the um, coverage and it doesn't feel like I have a whole lot of makeup on, which is very important to me. Okay, so next I will go in and add uh, a little bit of contour here. I uh, love this um, Tarte Pro Glow palette and I use this bottom one sculpt and I use this little spinner brush like that so we're gonna do that and then I also contour a little bit on either side of my nose and underneath my chin to kind of help with the slimming effect and then I will go in with this brush and this color it is kitty pink by dirty little secrets <laughs> obviously I use it a lot and just get the apples of my cheeks so here we go Okay, next I'm going to go in with this little brush right here. And normally I use this Urban Decay palette with this bottom color just to fill in my brows a little bit. They're microbladed, but I need to have them touched up. But for just the ease of getting ready, I'm gonna go back to this Tarte palette and I'm gonna use the same color that I used for my contour and then I will just go in and just set all of this around my eyes I'll use my beauty blender but then for the rest of my face I just use this little compact and I just kind of gently press all of the powder in just to kind of set it in place Now I'm gonna go in and do some eyeshadow. I talked about this palette the other day, the Too Faced Pumpkin Spice Palette. It is beautiful. So I'm just gonna probably go something subtle down here, um, these colors. So we will see. That last color was giving me a lot of uh, fallout. For some reason, I think it was my brush, but you can always just place a paper towel gently in case you're having a lot of it. Uh, but then I just go back with my beauty blender and just kind of touch up any fallout that I didn't get. All right, so the last thing that I'm going to do is my highlighter, lip liner, and lipstick, and lashes. I have lash extensions, so I uh, do not use mascara right now. When they start thinning, I will use mascara, but I just go in with this black diamond, and it is a liquid. So if you have long lashes and you don't necessarily even want to wear mascara, this will blacken them back up um, in case you have any fallout on them. Plus, it acts as like a protectant and a coat, uh, coat uh, seal it, <laughs> coats your lashes, seals them. Um, and then I have loved this for highlighter it is called glow milk it is a liquid it is so pretty and so i'll show i just put that i put a little bit here down the bridge of my nose right there on my cupid's bow and then i will use this soar lip pencil by mac followed by this lipstick is by rouge artiste it is called fiery 
sienna i really like it and then i will just top it off with this uh nyx butter gloss fortune cookie it's just a little gloss so stand by And there we have it. I promise it really doesn't take that long. Um, kind of got it down to a science from beginning to end. It might take me 10 minutes to do my makeup. And that's really only if I'm going somewhere. Uh, if I'm going to be around the house or teach virtually, I really just maybe some concealer and a little bit of lip gloss, but that is it. But uh, I will make a list of all the products that I used uh, just in case you have any questions about any of them. And um, there you go. Thanks for watching.